As always, we are operating outside the confines of Tipper's PMRC, so no explicit lyric sticker will be found here. If we offend, either closed-minded thinkers, racists, politricians, bourgeois elite, shut-eyed nationalists, organized religion, public education, or any other organization based on hate or thought control, it was completely premeditated and purposeful. Much love, and welcome to the Church of Best Intentions.
crisis. The current solution is perpetuated in purely economic terms, attacking the effects rather than the underlying causes. The prison industrial complex is sprouting up faster than schools in many parts of the United States. In contrast to this prison explosion, the public education system is becoming marginalized. Controlled state curriculum, lack of free thought, and the elimination of the arts are evolving school systems in another incarceration facility that still functions under government control and manhood. God bless the USA. Freedom demands responsibility. Contrary to popular belief, Anarchism is not merely the absence of rules or blind chaos. True anarchism functions under the individual free will of man and the belief that human disposition is innately good. With anarchy comes individual responsibility. 
Mental freedom is a personal struggle that is constantly growing, questioning, and liberating. Without internal evolution, a dissident will always dwell in hypocrisy. Freedom demands responsibility. Redneck vigilante bullshit, take 21. That there's a good number. <laughs> Investigation utilizing counterintelligence operations known as Cointel Pro carried out over 295 actions against African American organizations alone. These were programs that were deemed threatening to the Bureau's special interest. Many of these operations ended with brutal, murderous results. Well, that's a lie. My history textbooks ain't told me that. Yet. Although on paper, Cointel Pro no longer exists, today, national security is at the forefront of the dreaded war on terrorism. Popular legislature like the Patriot Act, combined with intricate propaganda, has deceived the frightened masses into allowing their civil rights to be eroded. Individual liberties are inalienable rights that cannot be squandered. Without them, fascist police states will reign supreme. National security, but at what cost? Power is not secure, and freedom is not ensured. Bub and Jeb may have hidden their white hoods in the back of the closet, but the hatred is still there, and it runs deep. You gonna go to that wool getter show? I'm there like the son of a bitch. Huh? I see cops speed past me every day. It's a nice profession. Good to be king of us civilians, of us inferiors. Cause you got your honor. Cause you're royal as hell. I wish I could wear your badge. Maybe trade uniforms. Hey, loan me your pistol and don't forget the ammo. And you can pretend to be looking rather evil. We have all seen a herd of cops who have beat the hell out of anyone cause they may fit a general prowler description. Cases of this sort of abuse flourish everywhere. Remember the case in the late 90s of the uh, young, college-bound, dark-complected guy walking through the park? If I remember right, his sin was pulling a candy bar out of his pocket. But nevertheless, it looked kind of reflective. Boom! Boom! Oh shit, I think I killed that guy. I hope I don't get demoted. Oh well, you never know when it could have been a gun. So we at least have to ask the question, how many cops are worthy of their position? At least until they turn the siren on for themselves. Fasten the cuffs and lock themselves in the back seat of the most run-down ghettos in their own Lord of the Manor hoods. My advice to you, earn your noble profession before you demand our loyal respect. Until then, we all struggle hard not to hate all of you. And similar to Che's ideology, I say, you can't hate until you exhausted all other avenues of solution. And let's not forget about the Green Party's platform, which includes election for all public officials, including cops as well as teachers. Rough take one. If you're out right, no thoughts of your own. If you're out right, no individuals here, you are our forces.
An 800 prayer line is open over oh, first a message from your favorite CD manufacturer. Helpful tips for safekeeping. While CDs may provide unsurmountable ecstasy, don't get so carried away as to feel you truly are on cloud nine. In a world where even the best and brightest forget that their stardom were unaided by the belief of so many others. Keep saying it out of here, so don't overlook where you came from. And if your ecstasy written ecstasy came from somebody else's CD collection, please humble them with your remembrance of what it is like to be human. How do you do it? By returning the gift unscathed. And remember, the golden rule isn't all bullshit. Oh, and take care of those CDs, at least for Memorex's sake. Hallelujah, hallelujah. Divine praise for our beloved corporate master. As I was saying, Carla, Jesus is the Lord. Boom. Shit. Hey, this one's for uh, the Woo! wagon wheel, shippies, and the bowl. The red dick rampage. Oh, I made my trucks louder than yours. Yeah. Hey, man, you want to head down to the rodeo? Drop the shit. Yeah. They got some prime Angus oh, down there. Yeah. Yeah. I got some kind yeah. butt over here. Yeah. <laughs> Let's fire it up. Sit around here and just jam out. Oh, we yeah. got two of them damn girls. There's one small team of all the lovers around here. We got like a else. Better to do, you know. God damn, it's going my NASCAR hand. Yeah, slap that on. We can go beat them some anarcho punks. Oh, get them punks. Trying to Step change the world. Oh, wait, Shit. Hey, 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 where's my whiskey? Yo, where's my porno? We all have to waste their time. Slap that ass. Let me get it here. Show me what you're working on. Really, it's about the good old days. Yes. Phantom Channel Cubs been a call with that this week. You crack me. White, white, white. Remember that day you caught that hog? Oh, that was a good day. Oh, I was stoned as hell that day. Ripped up, man. I was toasted, baked, you know, all that stuff. All in one. I'm so glad I found you guys. Time to scrawl the buck, bitch. Yeah, I'm probably getting stoned. You know, the testicles off my cow. <laughs> I learned that in Boag Day. <laughs> Communist cheap old liberal motherfuckers. Smoke a joint. The Clandestine Gorilla Action Network Collective. Here is representative Arnisto Consuela Rumsfeld. Thanks goes out to the OLD crew and the local legal skater throngs for giving the unyokel thought minded populace a better tomorrow. You know who you are. Word out to one of Green County's most progressive and influential, not so silent minorities. Action, baby. <laughs> 